Hi everyone, it's me, Hannah Medium, and here's my tips for reading oracle cards. The first and most important by far tip is what I want you to be focusing on when you're reading cards is not just working psychically and reading the energy of the person sat in front of you, but communicating with spirit guides because they will bring a whole nother level of meaning and understanding to your readings. And therefore, it's absolutely imperative that you chuck away or at least don't open the little book that comes with the cards. Because if you are reading the book and you are learning the meaning of the cards, then you are also going to be limited by those meanings. Whereas if you get a card and you can turn to spirit guides and say, what does this card mean? Show me what this means, explain this to me. They're gonna give you some wild and crazy and unexpected interpretations of those cards, which is gonna make such a difference to up-leveling your readings. Um, the other thing is don't get too focused on looking at the pictures, looking at the cards themselves. I've had some really dire readings in my time from people where they've just given me an audio description of the picture on the card and not actually given me any real reading of meaning. So get the gist of it and then unless you feel that you're being drawn to it for a specific reason, just let your mind and the information that flows with it just come to you and sit in that flow-like energy and allow the spirit world to inspire and shift and bring about the beautiful potential of the person that is sat in front of you. The other tip is not to overdo it. Um, I would suggest that practice makes perfect by all means. Pull yourself a card a day if you're trying to learn to develop those skills. And I would suggest either recording yourself reading it or writing down what you're getting. But don't start getting into that kind of space where everything that happens, you need to pull a card. Every moment that you live through, you need to pull a card because you need to remember that they are a tool. And the first rule of using cards is learning to communicate with spirit and energy without them. Hope this helps.